I put people on my controls and my gas valves back here. I need a, to record a one. I gotta change a gas valve, so I got all kinds of stuff back here. See if I can dig and find a. I need a to record a gas valve, three quarter in, three quarter out. Uh, standard pilot type of gas valve. Hundred, I think it's 160,000 BTUs. So let me do a little dig, and I think I might have. Let me see if I could find one. I'll bring you back if I. If not, I gotta go get one. Right here. See the 350. I think that's the one. Let me open it up. Yeah, that's it right there. Standing pilot. That's the one we need. Miss Molly! Whoa! Hit Miss Molly! How's my girl doing there, Miss Molly? Oh yeah, I love you, Miss Molly. Whoa! Hit Miss Molly! Oh, Miss Molly! This one's a minimum thirty thousand to two ninety. And I know it's three quarter coming in, three quarter up going out on the job I need it for. It's a standing pilot, and I need the 160. So once I get it in there, I have to set it. Uh, it does come with a with a half inch adapter also, but the the 35 is straight three quarter. The three, eight three zero zero means standing pilot. So we could use that one. We'll use that one on the job I'm going to. All right, come on, we gotta go. Sunshine, push over. Good morning, guys. It's February 26, 2021. Um, this one here, I got a call back on the job that I did uh, yesterday. I was there, and the um, pilot was out. I changed the thermal couple, and uh, we got it up and running. And it was very windy here that day, yesterday. I'm not making excuses, but it was really windy. And uh, you know, I did smell a little bit of gas around the boiler when I, after I was working on it and stuff. And uh, I sprayed all the joints down. I knocked it up as a downdraft because it was so windy out. But I guess the gas valve's leaking by when it shuts off a little bit. So the homeowner did smell some gas last night. And uh, they did they did shut off the unit last night and called me this morning. So I got a new gas valve right there. We're going to go change it out. I could have checked it with my combustion analysis meter by just shutting off the unit and seeing if the CO continued to rise, but I I didn't, it was my mistake. I'm letting you guys know that, you know. I'm, I'm human too, I make mistakes. I should have double checked that gas valve um, leaking internally once it shuts off, but I didn't. Shit happens, luckily nobody got hurt, and uh, we're on our way to go over there and fix it. I mean, we're all human and we all make mistakes, and it's just part of, part of life. No, I never said I was perfect. You can't be. You can't be perfect with everything. Sometimes, you know, things are things are questionable and sometimes you should do check things or do things differently than you do. It's just life. You know? Nobody's perfect, put it that way. The guy's got no 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 issues with it. I mean, uh, he called me last night and uh I'm going back over there and, and put a new one in there for him. No big deal. Alright, let me go in and do the job. I'll be right back. Gonna be waiting for me? Oh, yeah, you having a bad hair day? Are you having a bad hair day, Miss Molly? You having a bad hair day? Gas bell. Leaking from knob on top of gas valve. Gas leak. Shut off appliance. I thought we had checked that, but and either way, we're gonna change it now. Alright. I'm just gonna finish up about 15 minutes. Now.
Uh, I checked it, but maybe I didn't spray enough oil. Anyway, we'll change it. Shit happens. Unit's off, gas is off. 24 volts right here. This thing could have been leaking by when it shut off, too. It's possible. Alright, that's possible. Anyway, it's gonna get changed. So. I do have this aluminum pilot line in the truck if I need it, but I might be able to reuse this one. We'll see. I might be able to reuse it. Oh, it looks like it might be leaking from there. I don't know. Anyway, it's red tag. I gotta change it. We don't play around with gas valves if they're leaking. Not a good thing. Fuck around with it. Yeah, kitty, 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 kitty. Yeah, kitty, 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 kitty. <laughs> when in doubt, we change it out. <laughs> She's a crusty one, Mr. Grinch. She's a crusty one, Mr. Grinch. The new one might be a little bit different in size. Hey. About this? The new valve's gonna be smaller than this one, so I'm gonna need to change the one of the nipples here. I think I. I don't know if I can even. Uh, I might need a bigger wrench. No. We need a bigger boat here, Mama. We need a bigger boat. I'm gonna need a bigger boat. It's like on that movie Jaws. I think we're gonna need a bigger boat. Right, and then this thing has an arrow. I gotta put it in the right way. <sighs> this is gonna have to be changed anyway. To figure out what size nipple we need. Oh, that's half inch coming out. 
It's three quarter coming in. Alright, now three quarter going out, see it? Three quarter going out. And then half inch coming in, but we have to should be in the gap today. This is one for the half inch. There should be a block fitting in here I need for the other one here, this right here. For some reason that's not on the other gas valve, but I could use this one. Right, three quarter. I think that's yeah for three quarter, because this one's half inch. I need this. Most of the stuff sometimes I use them. I'll be buying a little bit to pick it up. Thanks. But for some reason, this one didn't have that block. Because this one's coming in half inch and going out three quarter. But I'm gonna use that other. So the block fitting here, it should be, should work, it's off the same valve. It's designed for that. Kind of weird.
Pulsen är på, ja. Det var inte kommit ut av bussen, men det kom ut av plate därefter. Which is kind of odd. Well, shit happens. And I did hit that other gas valve with the uh, the spray, but for some reason it didn't show up. I don't know. Well, shit happens. Shit happens. You ever hear that saying? that other side for us anyway so oh, we tighten that up I'm just kind of put that in there to get temporary for now we gotta we gotta dope up that up that lower joint there yeah right Seems like it's going downhill, yeah, but that's what it is. Can I tell you? It's tight. <clears throat> okay, so this, I should be able to loop it in there, maybe. If 
Come on, I got another piece of aluminum. Make sure that doesn't cross thread. It's going in nice and easy there. That's what we want. It's always best to do that by hand, but that didn't want to turn by hand, so I had to do it. Then we'll couple on this side. We're going to have to set the gas valve on this thing. Twenty-four volt wiring. Fucking okay. crazy here. Yeah. Sweating my ass off. Yeehaw. Put the flame on that thing. I'm gonna have to set it. I'm gonna set the gas valve for us, right? Put that flame. Wow. <laughs> Alright, so we'll see what this is when we turn it on. Five. That's close. Look at that shit, huh? Should be three five, so we're right there. Let's see what the pilot flame's gonna look like. Yeah, it's too high. Well, we can adjust the pilot flame down. I'm gonna check for leaks. And uh Put the combustion analysis meter on it and check for leaks. It just turns in to bring it down, right? I think it's way too high to pilot. how it's adjusted now. That's what we want, basically, like that. We don't want it too low, but we don't want it too high. So. Something like that's good. <clears throat> Alright, so let's change, take this out, put the thing back in there. The plug. Check for leaks and 
put the seal detect uh, fuel combustion analysis on it, make sure it's fine, but it should be. Make sure there's no leaks. Make sure nothing's leaking. We don't want a leaker. He's a leaker, Mama. She's a leaker. Make sure there's no leaks. Ready, set, go. Get my meter and check it. sprayed all this stuff, but no, should happen, Smaller. <clears throat> Alright, let's put the uh, seal detector in there and see what we got. I'm gonna set up for gas, let's set up for gas, natural gas. It should be good. Adjust the gas valve down a little bit, maybe. It was a, it was just over the three, three point five, right? It was three five one of two. It's actually passing right there. It's always good to put this door on, also. Yeah. She passes. She passes the smell test. I'll drop it down a little bit. It ain't gonna hurt. Gas valve, set gas pressure combustion test, leak detector salt test. Look another. I don't have to call the gas company on this tag. I want to change the valve. Little the parts there. So I did call the gas company. Usually on a repair like this one, it's just a gas valve. You don't have to call the inspector. So I called the called the gas company and uh, told them what I did and they're gonna send someone out to pull off the tag I usually check on it but it should be fine now new gas valve reset gas pressure combustion test leak test soap test <laughs> 